Although Lisa Marie Presley died suddenly on Thursday at the age of 54, when she was 9 there was a tragedy as her father died at only 42 after suffering a heart attack. During her school time she began with drugs. Speaking about her school years in a 2003 interview with the LA Times, she said, I was kind of a loner, a melancholy and strange child. I had a real self-destructive mode for a while. I never really fit into school. I didn't really have any direction. She married Danny Keogh in 1988 and had two children, but the marriage was failed. Her divorce was finalized in 1994 and right after three weeks she married the king of pop Michael Jackson. She later publicly announced the wedding by saying, My married name is Mrs. Lisa Marie Presley Jackson. My marriage to Michael Jackson took place in a private ceremony outside the United States weeks ago. The marriage was dogged by theories the pair had an asexual relationship, leading to Lisa Marie appearing in a suggestive video for his 1995 hit You Are Not Alone. But a year later, in 1996 the pair divorced. Later she married twice, but sadly divorced. However she followed her father footstep and pursued music career and in 2003 she debut album To Whom It May Concern. In 2009 Lisa broke into pieces as she described being shattered by the news of Jackson's death at the age of just 50. The king of pop lost his life and made everyone shocked and cried. The tragedy never ended, in 2020 her son Benjamin took his own life at the age of 28 and was deeply saddened. I have dealt with death grief and loss since the age of 9 years old, she said. I have had more than anyone's fair share of it in my lifetime and somehow, I have made it this far. Benjamin kept a low profile throughout his life, but had several acting credits and was also a musician. He was known for his strong resemblance to his late grandfather Elvis Presley. Let's just keep her in prayers and her family during this difficult time, don't forget to share this video. Your thoughts in the comments and like the video, thanks for watching.